Welcome and blessings magical community. Welcome to my channel Emerald Moon and to my first video. I'm going to be discussing what started me on the path of witchcraft, my initial resistance to the word witch, why I wanted to start my own YouTube channel and what my channel is going to be about. So I'm a witch living in the suburbs in Queensland, Australia. I've been practicing witchcraft for 18 months, so still very new. And when I first felt called to witchcraft, like I said, I felt um, resistant to the word witch and witchcraft. I felt I would never be able to call myself a witch. So I really had to look at why and where these connotations had come from. And I had to really dig in and find out why I felt this resistance to the word witch and witchcraft. And I asked myself, how many witches did I actually know? And how much of my own research had I done on witchcraft? And the answer to both of those was zero. So I decided to look into the pagan community. Um, at the when I first started, I couldn't find anyone in my area, so I went online. I went online and looked into the pagan community and what I found were these beautiful souls, these absolutely genuine people who wanted to help and who wanted to assist and guide newbies like myself, new witches, witchlings like myself. And I, I just thought that that was beautiful and it really cemented to me that yes, I wanted to be a part of this community. And I wanted to be surrounded by that energy and by these beautiful souls that I felt so touched by. So I started uh, researching and reading a lot uh, about witchcraft and what I found just lined up with everything that I felt in my heart with all my interests. So I had been um I had been looking and interested in studying psychology and personal development for ten years at that time that I felt I was being called, I um, had been working with the Divine Feminine. Witchcraft just, spelt, just spoke to my soul. I, I felt like I had found my place. I felt like I had found home. 
that it spoke my language. It spoke my soul's language. And the, the more that I have studied and read and listened to what other people and other witches have had to share, it just resonates with me on so many levels. And I absolutely love it. It was then that I decided that I was a witch. This was going to be who I was and who I am and who I will be for the rest of my life. So once I had made that decision, I wanted to find um, YouTube videos on big on, on witches that had started and begun down their path. N not just witches who were seasoned witches, because there were lots of those. Um, who had been studying witchcraft for 15, 20 years. And they had so much knowledge and I felt completely out of my league. I felt completely overwhelmed with the knowledge and information and I kept thinking to myself, to myself, how on earth am I going to catch up to be at the level that they are at. And I needed a starting point. Um, other witches were very helpful in guiding um, and giving information on where um, to look, um, good books to, you know, for the beginner witches, found lots of blogs on resources for the beginner witches, but other than that, there wasn't really a whole lot of information. I felt a bit lost in the beginning and I had to figure out because there was so much in, in witchcraft, there's so much information, which is one of the things that I absolutely love, that it's never boring. You will never ever learn it all. It's a continuous learning process because the breadth and the depth of witchcraft to me seems infinite and I love that. I, I love learning. I love knowledge. So that was also one aspect of witchcraft that really drew me in that really spoke to me. If I could find any videos about witches just starting out, like just getting that very, very, very first taste <clears throat> um, on their path, just dipping their toe, the tip, just the very tip of their toe in, then they never, they, they either didn't continue or they didn't um, continue on with um, recording their journey. So I felt a little bit lost. I felt a little bit on my own. And as I said, I couldn't find any... Um, community around my area only online so I did reach out in the um, online community Facebook and um, other social platforms and um, even the <clears throat> Australian 
groups that I could uh, find uh, that had witches and um, that were discussing witchcraft, they weren't in my immediate area. And I was looking for somebody who was like me, who was having the same feelings and emotions, the feelings of um, excitement and the feelings of overwhelm. when they started their path and that's exactly what I th I felt I felt a mixture of um, intense excitement and also being completely overwhelmed on where to start and I felt a a bit lost and alone. It was a confusing experience at the start um, and I just want to let anybody else know that is why I started this YouTube channel to let other new beginner witches know that if you are also experiencing this, it is perfectly normal because I went through it and I am sure I am not the only one. Uh, so for this channel, I will be sharing my journey and sharing my story as I walk my path as a witch living in Australia. So many blessings everybody. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching and hope you enjoyed this video. Blessed be.